Good day, I'm Joyce May Escabahu from BSN3E. I will demonstrate the measurement of the oxygen saturation using pulse oximeter. For the goal, is the patient exhibit arterial blood oxygen saturation within acceptable parameters or greater than 95%. For the equipment, check for oximeter. Oximeter probe appropriate for patient and recommended by oximeter manufacturer. Acetone or nail polish remover if needed. Pen and vital sign, flow sheet or electronic health record. Alcohol and cotton balls. The implementation review chart for any health problems that would affect the patient's oxygen status, especially if our patient is taking a medication or has a problem in the lungs. Close curtains around bed and close the door to the room if possible. Explain what you are going to do and why you are going to do it to the patient. This is to provide privacy. Perform hand hygiene and put on PPE if indicated. Identify the patient by simply asking for their name or check the door tag, the bed tag, or the wrist tag. Explain what you are going to do and why you are going to do it to the patient. This is to provide privacy. Select an adequate site for application of the sensor. Use the patient's index, middle, or ring finger. If circulation at the site is inadequate, consider using the earlobe, forehead, or bridge of nose. Use a tone, only on lower extremity circulation is not compromised. Prepare the monitoring site. Cleanse the selected area with the alcohol wipe or disposable cleansing cloth. Allow the area to dry because it can damage the sensor. If necessary, remove nail polish and artificial nails because it can alter the result. Apply probe securely to skin. Make sure that the light emitting sensor and the light receiving sensor are aligned opposite each together. Connect the sensor probe to the pulse oximeter, turn the oximeter on, and check operation if the equipment. Check oxygen saturation and regular intervals as ordered by primary care provider, nursing assessment, and signaled by alarms. Remove sensor on a regular basis and check for skin irritation or signs of pressure 
every 2 hours per spring tension sensor, or every 4 hours per adhesive finger or tone toe sensor to check for irritation. Clean non-disposable sensors according to the manufacturer's directions. Remove PPE if used. Perform hand hygiene. Document.